Hey guys, this is Maina from Civil Center and welcome all of you back to a fresh episode of Revit Architecture. So friends, today we're going to make a small building model in Revit Architecture using very simple commands. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So first of all, in today's video, we'll work with the MM or the metric unit. So first of all, uh, selecting template, we're going to select metric architectural template. We'll just clone click on OK and after that our file will open and after that we'll jump straight to an elevation here let's go to south elevation this will be our ground level and this will be our plinth level so we'll define our plinth level uh, to let's say up to approximately 4 feet so we'll just do this as 1200 enter so we'll insert another level above it so we'll go to architecture levels and then We'll select this option of offset levels, offset of 10 feet or 3000 and then we're going to enter this. We'll just go to create another level here so that it is a G plus one level. So after that we're going to jump to level two, door plans level two. Here we're going to simply select walls, wall architecture and this option we're going to take as finish face interior and after that we can select the height 3000 or 10 feet and after selecting the height what we are going to do is we are going to select the wall type so here you can select any wall type if you want to edit it just simply duplicate this suppose I want to go with a 250 mm wall or a 10 inch wall click on OK and here you can simply click on edit here change the value to 250 then click on OK and then OK once again and then we are good to start before that you can select on manage additional settings and here you have various options so among this you can just select temporary dimensions and make sure you have this faces for the walls and the openings for the doors and windows click on ok go back to architecture select the wall architecture 250 mm wall has been selected base constraint is the level 2 and we are going to construct a 3000 or 3 meter wall from the level 2 so we are going to work within this area so let's start our wall so we'll just go with a small room let's go with a small room of 3 meters into 4 meters so here we'll just make this straight and we'll go the width 3000 and after that as you can see we'll take the dimension from here so we'll just tick on 4000 so again we're just going to close on to this and we're going to close this so we have made a closed loop here so in Revit the 2d and the 3d plan is created side by side so you can check that also you can just go to this particular view default 3d view and here as you can see side by side this 3d was also created so now if we want to simply make a door here we'll just select a door so we'll select a standard door if you want you can change the size of this particular door also so we'll go with a standard 3 feet door and we'll go with 0.915 into 2134 mm so we can place the door anywhere just place the door anywhere and after you place the door you have this option of changing these faces as you can see selecting this you can change these faces as well as you can change the direction way in which the door is opening also you can change the dimensions also let's do it 500 
like this you can change the dimensions also for the doors so in this case we'll just do this as 200 at the side now you can also observe the changes in the 3d plan so now we can create a window here we'll just select a window and here as you can see we have windows of single casement and as well as double casement so we're going to select a window of double casement here and as you can see this is the size of the windows so this window size is 1.5 meters which is approximately 5 feet so we're going to select this and we're going to place the windows so we can place the window at the center as you can see you can select the both the dimensions check both the dimensions here windows have been made and here also we can set the windows at the center here so two windows for this particular room and then you can check this in the 3d view so if you want you can also just select this and go to the realistic view so in the realistic view you can observe the model so if you want to rotate the model just click on the shift button and the mouse middle button you can rotate the model easily so as you can see like this you can create a simple room in Revit software so if you want to see the elevations as well you can check the elevations from here this is the east elevation north elevation south elevation and the west elevation so these are the elevations and this is the 3d view of that particular room so friends how did you find this video please let us know in the comment section and if you want to find more videos of Revit architecture you can subscribe to our channel and also share with your friends for various other videos related to civil engineering so friends that's all for today bye bye see you in the upcoming videos